This one is one that I'm very interested to see how both of you are going to react to. I know about this film because I'm a huge fan of the, the director. So are you, Nick. Based off the book by Stefano Queen. Stefano Queen's If. <laughs> St Stefano Queen's If instead of It. Come on, dude. If, if what? Okay, so what do you get when you combine the studio that made Annihilation? Never saw it. The actor who plays Deadpool, Ryan Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds. And the director and writer of A Quiet Place Part 1 and 2. Oh. Ah. Hmm. John Krasinski. So this is the new John Krasinski movie? Yes. Cool. It is called If. And I've seen screenshots, but I'm reserving judgment until I see this. I'm interested to see, because as far as I'm concerned, John Krasinski can't really do wrong at this point. He's hit two home runs with the Quiet Place films. Yeah, I was going to say he's two for two, whereas Jordan Peele is like one... One and a half. One zero and a half. Like, basically. Yeah. You know, like He's like one and a half for he three. He got one home run, he got one terrible one, and then he got one that was kind of serviceable. Like, yeah. But... Just so you guys know, I didn't like us at all. I thought it was really stupid. I thought Us had potential, though, man. Us had so much potential. Uh, not Yeah, well, from the trailer, but, like, the actual movie wasn't really what the trailer portrayed it to be. So no, but... They tried to put too much reason and stuff behind what looked like a stream of consciousness trailer. And they ended up just making something that ended up being absurd. Yeah. Whereas, like, Nope is, like, a decent, moderately enjoyable alien film mm -hmm. that I feel like could have been possibly better maybe fair enough but overall it was like a, a 7 out of 10 at most mm -hmm. in my opinion. but better but better but, than us yeah it wasn't trash like us at least fair enough so if we're gonna check it out here this this I'm very interested to see what's gonna happen so we guess without further ado here we go. Hi. Well, looky, looky. She is the perfect fit, I promise. Did she even see you? She was about to. What are you doing? Don't do this. And oh, she's out. This is just so exciting. What is happening? Well, that's a perfectly understandable question given um, I'm an if. Get it? Imaginary? Friend? Oh, Our kids grew up. So we need new ones. You could save all of us. All of who? And don't say ifs. Let him say it or I think his head may actually explode. Thank you. Are you ready for this? Please. There's no telling who's behind that door today. We have to help them. Oh. Yes, we do. Again, put some pants on. You're freaking everyone out. <laughs> <laughs> wow. What a cast. Aquafina. Cheat! Yeah. Kind of a kid creates an invisible if. <laughs> Which one? You know damn well which one. Thanks, 
for doing this. It really means a whole lot. What the oh. fuck? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So it's not a horror movie. No. But imaginary friends. But here's the thing, knowing how old John Krasinski's kids are, mm-hmm. it makes sense that he would want to make something that also, would... Also, Ryan Reynolds has children yes. around that, yeah. And I guarantee so... you that's that's how he got Ryan Reynolds to sign on. Yeah. yeah. I think they're probably making this for their kids. I would say so, but... To but... be honest, mm, I'm not really that interested. Well, I, I'll say this, the imagery, very beautiful. Like, say what you will about John Krasinski. These, like, the shots that are in this film, like, everything is just so well done. Like, right here, uh, with her, yeah, just, like, the shadows that are, like, like, the character, like, the imaginary characters, the ifs, are being portrayed very well in the real world. Like, the shadows. It, I get a, like, a Roger Rabbit kind of feel from this. Mm-hmm. And this right here is great. Also, I love the old school, you know, yeah. the pie eye animation. That's what they call that, the pie yeah. eye animations. Pac-Man eyes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but the imagery and just the world that they're building here with, there's a real world, and then there are caretakers, it looks like caretakers for imaginary friends who have to basically usher them on to new kids or like usher them on to new people. Mm-hmm. That's what it looks like and that's what it sounds like. Um, but <laughs> right here, this guy just, I, I'm sorry, I know that this isn't him, but I saw this right here and I was just like, is, no, no, I was like, is that Meat Canyon, the dude? I know it's not, but, but yeah, I first saw this guy, I was just like, Grimace? I, I had that thought, too. <laughs> uh, and then, of course, you have, uh, but okay, like, these, like this right here, this is, like, I love the shots here of, like, the carousel, and, of course, him channeling his inner Steven Spielberg with the spotlight fetch. Jesus Christ, what is it with... Like, I can't watch a Steven Spielberg film now because I've I've been made I've been made privy to uh, Steven Spielberg's spotlight fetish. Everything's always like in the glow of a spotlight in the background. <laughs> I, I can't unsee it now. Uh, but also all the other ifs and everything. I just yeah. I don't know, but like this right here, this is super creative. Basically, this if is, I guess this is an if for like a child artist. Mm-hmm. And then Ryan Reynolds just got stuck in the middle of the painting and just like had to cut it. Like, <laughs> I, I don't know. There's just so much here that I'm, I'm, I like the creativity. Yeah. And for a kid's film, I could definitely see this, you know, hitting some good chords with people. But that being said, we'll see how it is whenever it comes out. But John Krasinski so far has done great work, and I'm sure this will be great too. It's got a lot of, it's got like an all star cast. Oh, yeah. Too. Huge cast. Matt Damon. Yeah. John Aqu- Aquafina, she's the she plays. Oh, it's got Steve Carell too. Yep. But Aquafina is um, uh, Sisu from Raya and the Last Dragon. Yeah. She's also in uh, what's that movie? Crazy Rich Asian. She's the friend. Yeah. yeah. She's, she's also. She's really funny. Yeah. I like Aquafina. She can be. She can be pretty. It's got funny. Emily Blunt. Yes. Well, of course it's got Emily yeah, Blunt. She's she's wife. married to. <laughs> and he's in the movie too. Yeah. And then of course Maya Rudolph, John Stewart, Sam Rockwell, Louis Gossett Jr. Oh, Fiona Shaw, aka uh, uh, what's 
what's uh, there's Vernon and the Dursleys, the wife. I think. Oh. Yeah. Uh. Petunia. Petunia, yes. Petunia Dursley. Uh, that's Fiona Shaw. Right. Yeah. I think so. And if not, they'll correct us in the comment section. So yeah, that it was if the official teaser trailer. I mean, I I would be interested in this if I was a kid. I'd be very interested. Heck, as an adult, I'm, I might be interested in seeing it anyway. Who knows? <laughs> but either way, I think that's going to do it. So, yeah. What do y'all think? Do y'all want to watch it? It's like a really cute movie, but it'd be yeah. more kid-oriented. Yes, of course. Yeah, yeah. obviously more kid-oriented. But either way, what do y'all think? Do you all think it'll be interesting? Let us know in the comments down below. And... Till next time, I'm Nate. I'm Kate. I am Nick. Y'all be good people. Take care. Peace.